as most places around central and northern New York see their caseloads flatten out a little bit, Ma Madison County has seen a major spike in COVID-19, caseloads doubling just in the last few days. Some of the new cases are coming out of the Grand Rehabilitation and Nursing Home in Chittenango, where the county lost its sixth neighbor Monday. Yeah, but the largest hotspot is coming out of a brand new greenhouse in Oneida. News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc joining us live now at the site. Now, Julia, what can you tell us about all of these cases and the spike? Well, Dan and Jennifer, we're told around 400 people work here at Green Empire Farms, plus the construction workers who are still building on the property here. So when a couple of cases of COVID-19 popped up over the weekend, Madison County health officials reached out to the state for help with testing other employees as a safety precaution because of those pop-up of cases there. Now, they tested around 186 people, and as they suspected, around 100 tests came back positive for COVID-19. We're told 50 of those people live in Madison County, and the others are seasonal workers from Oneida County. Out of those employees from Oneida County, health officials say none of them are hospitalized from the virus. Now, this brand new facility is owned by a company called Sunset, and they tell us they're concerned about this new hotspot and are now working to keep everyone safe. All employees are to wear masks. They're doing daily temperature checks, drastically in clean, increasing cleaning measures, and using social distancing. Now, we're expecting to learn more about these cases at Green Empire Par Farms at a news conference today at 10 a.m., where county health officials will be giving us information, everything they know right now, as well as that mini hotspot we talked about at Grand Rehab Nursing Center in Chittenango, where we lost the sixth neighbor in Madison County Monday afternoon. Live in Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9.